We didn't let anyone give toasts. Because I feel like half the toasts you're going to hear at any wedding are going to be terrible, right? <laughs> Often from men. Because <laughs> again, I don't think that's something a lot of straight guys, gi we give ourselves this emotional access to, to be tender with our friends. So it just comes out real aggressive. <laughs> bridesmaid speeches, almost always really great, right? They're all very similar, but they're all very lovely. Every bridesmaid speech is like, Lisa, first of all, you are a goddess. <laughs> that white dress, I can't even right now. You are like a living, breathing Beyonce. Hashtag flawless, hashtag woke up like that. <laughs> and it is so beautiful to be here with you while your childhood dream comes to life. Just the way the Ouija board said it would when we were nine years old. <laughs> Congratulations, I love you so much. Then they kiss with tongue. Women do that when they're friends. Not a big deal, no stigma, just pals being pals. It's nicer that way. Every groomsman speech I've ever witnessed may as well have been delivered by the groom's worst enemy on planet Earth. Every dude comes out just like, hey, Maddie! Fat Matt. Count Crapula. See, we call him that because one time in elementary school, he pooped his pants on Halloween in a Dracula costume. <laughs> Remember that? I know you do, Count. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> Anyways, I never thought you was going to be married. I never thought you were going to be married. I swear to God, never thought in a million years. I always assumed you would have died years ago while having sex with a candle up your microwave. That's just what I thought was going to happen. What you said, be honest. I'm talking from the heart. Shut up, Fitzy. Let me finish. I'm being nice. It's a funny story. <laughs> this guy. Anyways, I don't know whether you got like some kind of cage you keep this woman in at night. Or like a complicated financial arrangement that makes it difficult for her to flee you, but... Either way, bro, you locked it down, so congratulations, no homo, where the bridesmaids at? And that's every groomsman speech I've ever witnessed. And every single time I'm like, that guy's the best man? He's the best one of those you've ever met? What are your other friends, scarecrows full of bees? 